Lots of cords. So, one, when you're doing this drill, really make sure that, I mean, if you want to take your foot off the ground like that, your front foot, that's fine. But make sure that you get your heel back down as you start to move forward. So you're getting on your toe. Okay? So, if you would get your foot down right here in this position, okay, and maintain this angle in your front leg, that's a good angle right there. Okay, and then just start turning, your elbow would stay in a much better arm slot. But that knee, you really, from this position right here, you know, and you really, that elbow is still kind of creeping up a little bit. That's, that's a lot better than what it was. Okay, but then from right here, all you're gonna really do is push. You're pushing things forward. See, because we can see how we still see your belt buckle right there. That belt buckle should be disappearing around your body. Okay, and then it's push, 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 and the arm is, you're not getting very much external layback here, see? It's, it's, it's not as much, we want it to be like that almost. And now look at that angle, see your heel's almost behind your front knee. See, you're still pushing, still pushing. And that's why this is really, it's too much. You're, you're collapsing on your backside, and that's why this is staying so bent because you're pushing into it instead of from this position rotating and firming that leg up. Does that make sense? Yeah. Your, your, your elbow is a lot better though in this position than it was before. Okay. See, you're just staying soft there. Right here, it should be totally firmed up. Ball's all the way out of your hand. Okay.